Rob Natalie Blue. Number 114.2. Is it 24? We're back from the mountains. We're back from the mountains. The rejuvenating effect of the mountains. So I'm going to begin talking, or continue talking, I should say, about the uh, relationship between the newly discovered Van Allen belts, discovered in 1958, and linked below a Wikipedia page. Uh, the discovery that the miles and the dimensions of those Van Allen belts match the dimensions and miles of a map of the so-called spirit spheres created in uh, 1916 by J. Hewitt McKenzie. So that means there's these spirit spheres where you go. The conclusion is that there's these spirit spheres, spheres that you go to when you die. Everyone goes to when you die, regardless of religion or faith or belief. And anybody you know can be found there, including our friend Jimi Hendrix. I'm from a generation of uh, musicians who were influenced at a very basic level by Jimi Hendrix. So um, Jimi Hendrix, that means Jimi Hendrix is in our spirit sphere. So I'm trying to make this not too kooky, but uh, we think about the spirit sphere, spheres, we talk about the spirit spheres, and we do it in terms of people that we know who are in the spirit spheres. And one person we all know in the spirit spheres, James Marshall Hendrix. So he's in our spirit sphere. Who's in yours? That's the question you ask yourself. Thanks. See you. Bye.